Now let's try the left flip. So first of all, you can see this region as red. So my hand needs to be inside here to detect all the gestures. So here you can see uh, if I bring it out, if I bring it in. So now if I want the drone to go up, I will point up. If I want it to go down, I will do a victory sign and it will go down. Then if I want it to go right, I will do this. If I want it to go left, I will do this. And if I want it to flip, I will do this. So again, you can add more gestures as you wish. But the main idea is that it will not happen anywhere else. It will happen only next to your face. If there is no face, there will be no gestures uh, detected. So it is kind of a safety feature that uh, so that if I'm if my hand is like this and I'm not detecting the gesture properly, it will detect properly when it is inside this region. So you can put it on the left side, you can put it on the right side, and it, it is also checking if you're using the right hand. If you're using the left hand, it will not work. You see, even now it says it is red. So it will not detect any gestures. It will detect only if it's a red hand. So these are some of the restrictions that we add deliberately so that uh, it is easier to control so that the drone doesn't fly away anywhere. So let's go ahead and test it out in real time and see how it flies. So let's try going to the right. Then we are going to try the left. And now let's try the left flip. There you go. And now let's try going up. There you go, it goes up. Then let's try going down. It goes down. And let's try going back up. We need to be next to the face to make it work. Then we will go up further. And now let's flip again. So as you can see, all of the gestures, they are working fine. But the thing is, they have to be near my face. Otherwise, it will not be detected. If I do it from here, it will not detect. Because of the red box, you can see it's not valid. If I go in, then it will detect. And it will do the flip. 